Let's make sure that in your next Zoom meeting, they're focused on you and not behind you on your Star Wars collection. On your Zoom calls, we don't wanna have the background too distracting or too close up really. We want the focus to be on you and your bright shiny face. Right now I'm recording with a professional camera and lens. So the background is gonna be a little bit blurry, but you gotta remember that you're most likely gonna be using your phone camera or the camera on your laptop and neither of those have that blurry background thing going on. So keep your background relatively simple unless you're sitting in front of a bookcase because that makes you look smart. One other cool thing that you can do with the Zoom app is to use a virtual background. What that means is you're gonna replace the live background, whether that's your kitchen wall or bookcase or whatever, with a picture. There are some pictures included on the Zoom app and you can certainly use those, but if you'd like to get a little bit more creative and use something that fits your personality just a little better, then maybe you could find something that has a little bit more interest to you. I really hope these insights help you rock your next online meeting. See you next time.